I've just hit record on this race because it looks like a good one to be able to show you what's going on. Just showing you the tick offset tool in BetJet Pro and just how fast this thing is and how many trades it allows you to do. I'll go and get the video up so you can see the horse I'm trading here. It's this Hudson de Grugy thing. It's in the pink and it's sitting there second last on the fence. And as long as it doesn't go forward, it's just there in the blue and pink. And I'm just firing in the tick offsets, and you can see by the speed of it how quickly they're getting matched, and just how quickly you can enter the bets. So I'm just going to keep an eye on him there. As long as he doesn't come forward, his price isn't going to drop too much. He's just holding nicely there now. And most of that money offsetting is mine anyway, so there's a, a big jump. I'd say he's going to stuff this jump up a bit, because it seems there's some drones out there so something's happened a little bit in front of us there or maybe not there was no jump but the market didn't seem to like him there for a minute but that's okay we'll keep going in at 7.6 7.8 all around this area we're just firing them in i just can't believe how fast this is it's just incredibly quick and we're getting a nice profit here there's no one really looking at him because he's second last most of the in running traders looking at the front end of the market he's gone in front of one horse there but you can see nothing's really changing we're still going all right so I think we're getting up just sort of past halfway, I think. We're going to look to try and get 30 quid out of this. Then we might just stop, see if we can get a late lay-in. This is what the normal way we operate. I'm still just firing in at the same prices. Nothing's changing in the race and nothing's moving. He's really starting to push on the inside there. So we might start drifting here, which would be lovely. See if we can get a couple more in. He's just starting to struggle a bit. He was pulling early, so... That's what alerted me to him in the first place. So he's not going past anything here. We'll get a couple more, and he should start coming up now. We've hit our 30, so we can exit now. He's back to last. So he's got to come up now. There we go. Get out at 8.6. Hedge it up. Get that matched at 8.8, and we're done. Cancel that last bet. Come on, there we go. Very nice. So we've picked up 36 at this point. Now we'll look for our final lay, and I'm going to use the race meter for this and show you how that works. So we're going to have a look here, and you can just watch the race meter, and it'll tell you which one is struggling. What I'm looking for is something that was in the orange in contention, and then is starting to drift back. So I'm going to go and hit this one here. There we go. Hit the lane. We're matched there. And now I just go and watch for the profit. And just make sure he doesn't go orange or green again. So now he's drifting out nicely. Out he comes. Hit the exit. Done. There we go. 45 pounds. 49. And now you don't care who wins. But what a race this is. Have a look at it. Now, the market seems to think this favourite has won. There was a big move on it just there. And even though it looks close on the pitches, you can see the drone users, whoever's there, or on track traders, they've made their decision that this leader's not getting caught, no matter what the pitches look like. And no, he's not. He's going to go on to win. My guy ended up coming, oh, looks like he's going to come third, just maybe second. But as you could see from the race meter, he was never in contention. So there we go, 45 49. If we go and have a look at the bets that we made, and you'll see how many bets we managed to get in on that runner. So if I go down to the bottom, we can add them up because each £10 bet at the price will show. So there's eight there, plus six at 7.4, that's 14. There's 19 there, plus another six, that's 25. There's 26. Another three there at 7.2, so that's 29. There's one there at mixed prices, so that's 30. 35, and then another 40, 39, 42. So we've got 42 tick offset trades done, and then the other one on the other horse. But that is just incredible. So the speed of this is phenomenal, and I hope you enjoy it as much as I am.